Welcome back everyone to some more Plague Tale Innocence. So we are doing chapter 11. Let's I go think. take a look. This at least I know how to do. There you go. Well, that was efficient. And almost painless. Come on, let's go. Whoa. Can you feel that? No, what? When you enter a place that has been abandoned for a very long time, there's something in the air. Yes, dust. No, the stones. It's like interrupting a conversation. <sighs> this is the first time I felt it here. Hmm, that looks dangerous. Let's avoid it for now. Another door. Shall we continue? Of course. Let's see where this leads us. Oh, the courtyard. It's a shortcut. <laughs> Can we craft anything? Oh, hey! I almost forgot. I found something while I was doing some clearing earlier. Come take a look. Another story about stones? <sighs> Not bad. Not bad at all. Where'd he go? Oh, he's down there. I figured I'd craft something while I was there. A fresco. It's strangely familiar. It includes the symbols of the pillars. This castle has things to tell us, huh? And what is it telling us then? Even I don't understand everything. I just think we'll be fine here. Amicia! Come quickly! It's Hugo! Oh no. I'm coming! Need me? Uh, I'll call you. Come on! Come on! I'm here, Lucas! I hope this is not a really short Quickly, chapter. Quickly, Hugo. Please. It's getting worse and worse. The macula is progressing too fast. I realize that, Amicia. I'm doing my best. I... I mean, I'm trying to do what the book says, but it's going to take too long. I need a proper laboratory. Like Laurentius had? No. No. One with better equipment. Well, perhaps my mother at my home. She must have had some equipment there. You're right. It's worth a try. Amicia! Lucas! I believe your twins are back. You found him! More... dead than alive. But yes. Amicia, we... we came because... well... Yes. Arthur, you tell her. After our little adventure with your heretic burning friends, I ended up in an Inquisition cell. One day I saw the guards accompany a prisoner who looked the worse for wear. Those bastards wanted her to tell them where her son was, so... They threatened her. And I heard her name. Beatrice Storum. Mother is alive? She's alive? You managed to get Arthur out? It wasn't simple. Believe me. So you could... Forget it. I was nothing. But she... She's too important to the Grand Inquisitor. He, uh... Questions her... A lot. They... Torture her? Hugo mustn't know anything of this. Even that she's alive? It might help him. And what will we say when he wants to see her? Tell him nothing, all right? Ah! Oh no! Hugo! Hugo! Ah! Ah! The next threshold, ah! it's coming. We have to go at once, to my home, now. You go, we'll stay here with him. It will be all right, my little brother. I swear, this time we will heal you. All right. I'll get the Sanguinity Genera, and some potions, and then we'll leave. Really? We're here. Amicia, you're going to be all right. Yes. It's just... 
Strange to be back. Let's go. I never thought I'd come back here. Not so soon. We find the potions and we leave. You might even get home before sunrise. Fine by me. Well, unfortunately, this is a very short episode, but I'm going to put it out on the same day as the next one, just because this is only like five minutes long. So, for what it's worth, I hope you enjoyed. Until next time, bye-bye.